Today we are going to be solving one of the biggest mysteries here in the Fortnite community that we've seen in recent times and it involves this emerald pickaxe right here which according to online sources is actually a free pickaxe you can get a part of a new collaboration. Now before we dive into that we got to go to the shop and send our daily gift to a lucky subscriber. If you guys want to receive a gift in a future video all you have to do is drop a like, make sure you are subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on and also leave your epic usernames down below so I can add you and send you the gift. And a big shout out to everyone using code NERP2 in the Fortnite item shop Shop, you make the videos possible so thanks for the support I appreciate it now the mystery of the emerald axe is actually very very interesting because stuff like this happens in the Fortnite community a good bit but I've never seen an item like this gain so much traction and interest over a short period of time but recently over the last day or two over on my TikTok, Twitter and Instagram out of all of the different clips and images I've seen regarding Fortnite a lot of them are talking about this emerald axe which as you guys can see is an all green emerald version of the star one pickaxe which is honestly one of the most popular pickaxes here in the fortnite community it's a very clean axe there was exploits with it before and a lot of professional fortnite players seem to really like this axe and use it which of course then influences a lot of other people to use it as well so the axe itself does have some history but it's interesting that they decided to choose this one to give an all green emerald version too and i think the reason that this all initially started a few days ago was because we were coming up on saint patrick's day which was actually yesterday, Friday, March 17th. All right, I just realized we're rocking the all green inventory challenge too. We're not even doing that on purpose. We're just getting some garbage loot, man. Where's the better Where's the better weapons? But it initially started on Twitter, which is where I saw the original images. Uh, and it came from an account that was trying to be an imposter to Fortnite, which I think is why it gained so much traction in the first place. There is someone fighting over here. We're gonna take him out real quick. Get lasered. Oh my God, dude, the bloom did not miss there. That was insane. Does this guy know I'm here? Okay, I don't think he knew I was there, but he- that guy seemed kind of lost. But this Fortnite imposter account tweeted saying, Hello everyone, we are proud to announce that we have partnered with the app Timu to exclusively release the Emerald Axe. Just download Timu, the shopping app, and type in this code, accept and create an account with your Fortnite username to claim. And this was basically the first leak that got everyone talking about this. And from there, they actually created a few more promotional images that looked very legit and very real. Which is why a lot of people were thinking this is something that could be legit, and that's where the mystery uh, basically started. As you guys can see by the artwork and the different uh, promotional images they made, they did a really good job because they actually do seem very believing and uh, very real. But after doing a little bit more research, I actually did find a few people that downloaded the Timu app and tested this out to see if it was a legitimate collaboration that maybe Fortnite just hasn't announced yet. Oh, hold on, there's Tangos. Boom. Oh, my aim's so bad. Boom, one more. There we go. I knew he was weak. And we have Meowskills over here just dancing with his yarn. What's up, man? I'm going to take these chests from you if you don't mind. Thank you, good sir. But it seems to me that they were trying to replicate an old pickaxe that actually came out a few years ago for St. Patrick's Day, known as the Emerald Smasher, which is basically the OG St. Patrick's Day harvesting tool that was released either back in 2018 or 2019. And as you guys can see, it does have green on it, but it doesn't really follow that true emerald style like the emerald axe that was just recently teased. And after further investigation, I did realize when I was going to download the app to try this for you guys, that Timu is literally a shot app for clothes so initially it didn't really make sense that Fortnite would be doing a collaboration with them and right away it kind of made me think that this was actually fake and of course after doing a little bit more testing and actually having other people test different codes that were put out on the internet as well no matter what code you use this did not work and it did not grant you anything special or even a discount on the app hold on there is a bad guy oh well, there was a bad guy. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm not gonna lie. The first few days of the season, I wasn't a big fan of this shotgun, but now... Oh my god, dude. There are so many people, but now it's my favorite because I realized if you zoom in with this thing, it definitely hits like a truck. And now we got a purple version, which is even better. So yeah, basically, to solve the mystery of this new Emerald Axe, uh, unfortunately, it is all a hoax. Uh, props to the people that started it because like I said, there has been things like this in the past where people obviously make fake promotional images and with there being very good artists out there, sometimes 
sometimes it is pretty difficult to tell between what is real and what is fake online. And I feel like it gets harder every single day with how good AI and advancements in technology are. But uh, for this one to get so much traction to where I even saw a lot of YouTube videos with lots of views talking about this, I had to make a video uh, basically giving you guys the rundown of how this all uh, came to be. And of course, my experimenting with it as well to see if it would actually work. Because my theory is I never believe something unless I test it out for myself and get the proof myself. So yeah, if any of you guys were thinking of downloading Timu and using these codes and all this, don't waste your time. It's not going to work. Obviously, it is all fake. But uh, kudos to the people that started it, man. You guys did a good job. And it created a lot of hype over these very short few days, which I think is very impressive. Oh, we got a rift forming here. What is going to spawn in here? What are we going to get? Oh, what the heck? Oh, shoot. Okay, Big Daddy was coming for this as well. Oh, it's only one box. I thought it was gonna be a bunch, dude. Now, the good news for you guys that clicked on this video thinking you were gonna be able to get a free pickaxe is there is actually a free pickaxe that's gonna be coming out here very, very soon a part of a new PlayStation Plus celebration pack. We did talk about this in our video yesterday, but it's only fitting to recover this real quick since I know a lot of you guys are probably still wanting a free harvesting tool, but you guys can actually get this harvesting tool right here along with a weapon wrap and also a emoticon. And all you have to do is sign into a PlayStation account that has PlayStation Plus active, link your Epic account, and then go to the PlayStation Store and search this up, and you can download these for free. And the best part about it is even if you guys do not own a PlayStation, all you need to do is have a friend or buddy that owns a PlayStation, and they can sign into your Epic and get this reward for you, so it's very, very easy. Now, of course, if you are someone that does not play on PlayStation and you have no friends that play on it, then you are kind of out of luck because there's really no workarounds to getting this other than having a friend that does have a PlayStation, but there should be a lot of you guys that can still claim it, so make sure to get that. It is going to be coming out on the final week of March, so probably here in the next 7 to 10 days. And I also thought I should include, uh, hopefully you guys all had a fun and safe St. Patrick's Day. Yesterday was a pretty fun day, so I hope you guys all enjoyed yourselves. There we go, man. I'm glad I picked up the sniper. Sniper is feeling cheesy right now. Oh, yeah. We are feeling good, boys. We are dialed. That's two for two. Where is our next victim? There he is, and now he's dead. Let's go, dude. Oh, man, I'm so glad they brought this thing back. It reminds me of OG Fortnite just hitting really nice snipes. Like, that was one of my favorite things about the first few seasons of Fortnite was getting the original bolt and just dinking headshots from, like, two to 300 meters out. Nothing more satisfying than hitting those. What? Oh, that's... Dude, what? I thought that that was a real player, and I was so confused how I just did 330 damage, and this man just took it like a champ. And of course, it's the big boy polar bear, so he takes even more damage. Oh, I actually hit him. Oh my god, I can't believe I hit that shot. Yeah, I got bored, so we're just going for it, man. I don't even care if we win this game. These games are so long now that it's, it's just so boring just waiting around. Yeah, get out of this bubble. Bro, I, I hate the sword so much. Oh, okay. There was still one more over there. What? There was still another man over here. You know what? Nice shot, man. Good shot. There's not much I could do about that. I didn't even know where this man was. He was hiding in the trees. GG. What an unfortunate and anticlimactic way to end the game. Just get sniped in the head, right? It's only fair, though. We were popping people in the head as well. But that's all I got for you guys today. If you guys enjoyed and are excited for these upcoming free rewards, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you're brand new, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, my friends.